in this session let's perform the hot backup we know if we need to perform the hot backup the database should be in a archive log mode right so let's see if the database is in a archive log mode or not so for that we will use the command archive log list okay database log mode is archival mode and automatic archival is enabled okay that's good and you see the archive destination is disk 2 prod 1 arch folder okay that's good next let's find out where our data files are so let's get the file name from dba data files okay they are all present in disk 2 prod 1 data folder even though we have our undo data files in the same folder we don't need them normally undo data files will not be there in the same folder but here we created in the same folder that's fine we can ignore them or copy them really we don't need this undo data files okay now let's see where the control files are name from v dollar control file okay they are present in disk 2 prod 1 control okay that's good we have two control files so now let's find out the current log sequence number okay so let's get the group number sequence number status from v dollar log okay the current one is group number one and sequence number 31 okay remember this 31 and group number one now let's go ahead and put the database in the backup mode alter database begin backup the database is altered and is in a backup mode let's make sure all the data files are in a backup mode okay so for that select file number status from v dollar backup all the 11 files are in active status that means all these files are in a backup mode now let's open a new terminal and now let's go back to the root and let's go to disk 1 and here let's create a directory hot backup you can create whatever name you want okay now let me come back and let me go to disk 2 let me go to prod 1 and here let's see what is there we have the archival folder control folder and the data folder okay let me copy the data folder to disk one hot backup folder now all the data files present in the data folder are copied to the folder disk one hot backup it will take some time because the data files are huge right okay it is copied now let's go back to disk one hot backup and let's see here we have a folder called data let's go and let's see okay all the data files are copied to the hot backup folder that's good now let's go back to the database and take out the database from the backup mode for that alter database and backup database is altered now let's make sure the files are not in a active mode okay status from v dollar backup okay they are not active that means they are not in the backup mode now let's archive the current log file for that alter system archive log current so the current log file is archived and now 
let's check the group number sequence number and status from v dollar log you see the current is 32 what was our sequence number when we started the backup it was 31 right so we need to back up all the archive logs which are between 31 and 32 we need not back up 32 only the sequence numbers between 31 and 32 so here it's only one so it's 31 suppose example if the current one is 35 then we need to back up 31 32 33 and 34 okay so here we'll back up only the 31 archive log so before we do that let's back up the control file let's back up the control file using alter database backup control file to single quotations slash disk one slash hard backup slash and let's give the name as control dot bk okay and let's execute that it says no such file or directory actually it's disk one right so let me correct that copy paste one slash hard backup slash control dot bk okay we are getting the error permission denied okay let's see if we have permissions on that hard backup folder or not so let's go to disk one and let's list the directories okay hard backup is created but you see the owner is root so let's change the owner to oracle hot backup the owner is changed now let's go back and execute this alter database and the control file is backed up if you want let's go here and check it out so cd hot backup and you see here control dot bk that's good let's finish the final step which is copying the archival log file 31 so we will go to disk 2 we'll go to prod 1 here we'll go to arch folder and then let's list you see the one with the group number one and sequence number 31 so we need to copy this file so I will copy that file let me copy that copy paste to disk one slash hot backup and the file is copied now let's go back to disk one slash hard backup and let's check all the files we have the data folder which contains all our data files we have backed up the control file which is control.bk and we have backed up the required archive redo log file okay we have successfully completed the hot backup Practice this, okay?